Hello internet world and welcome to another unboxing on the Geek & Noise channel. This is the Mio MyView 798 dash cam. This is a little bit different though, it's not a full HD dash cam, it's a 2.5K or 1600p dash cam with GPS and plenty of features packed inside. This is my unboxing and first look. If you want to see the full review of this, please do check out the link down in the video description. On the side here, you can see it's got a Sony Premium Starvis Optic Sensor, so it should deliver really good quality video. Also a 2.7 inch size LCD display, maximum 1600p at 25 frames per second, and then the lower resolutions take it up to 30 frames per second. 150 degree viewing angle on the camera, and I have actually reviewed quite a lot of dash cameras during my years of doing videos on the Geek & Noise channel. And I've also reviewed my view dash cameras before, and they normally deliver really good quality, nice detail in the video capture. We've got some extra features listed across the back here. I will cover all of these features in the full review, but we've got things like collision detection, that 150 degree wide angle view, uh, really good lens by the looks of it. I can't read that, it's, I think it's an f1.8 aperture lens, also parking mode as well, wide dynamic range, etc, etc. And let's take a look inside. We're presented with the camera, first of all, in the top of the box. Let's take a quick look at this. So nice looking compact unit. You can see here wide QHD written on here. We've got some controls around the side for navigating through the menus. Then on the back, we've got that 2.7 inch screen and also the protect button for protecting recordings. And we've also got the main power on off, input for the power. And then just above the lens on the top here, this is where you're gonna use the mount system. And on the bottom, we've also got the micro SD card slot. Further down into the box, we have got the mount itself. This is a suction type mount that's gonna adhere the camera to your windscreen. We also get a really generous length uh, 12 volt vehicle accessory power adapter. This is gonna bring power to the camera. And this is normally long enough so you can hide the cable in the headlining of your car. And then further down into the box, we have got some warranty information and also a quick start guide to get us up and running. That's pretty much it for this unboxing. I'm really looking forward to testing this. As I say, I actually personally run a MyView camera in my vehicle, and I've been very pleased with it over the years, so I can't wait to test out this new model. Link down below to the full review, and if you wanna pick one up for yourself, there's also links to where you can actually purchase this particular dash cam. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in another video very soon.